welcome to Imperfectionist Gaming. Welcome back to more Tears of the Kingdom. Hope you guys are enjoying this, and thank you so much for watching. Where is Pura? Bill said, tell me where Pura is. It does not help that my map looks like this. Is this the wetlands? Is that why it's that color? Yeah. Stop turning around, you dipshit. Okay, there we go. We're going that way. Is that it? Oh. That big giant rock over there? Okay, maybe that's it. Hello, horse here. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> it's like he was just running and then was like, ah. <laughs> Did not see you there. What are you carrying, bud? What'd you catch? Oh. Oh, okay, he didn't catch that. I was like, oh, why is he eating one of their people? Okay. I'm guessing it's this. Whoop. Oh, no. Ah. Maybe there's a better way across here. Like some stairs or something crazy like that? That'd be amazing. Oh, yeah, I think I see some stairs. Ah, Kakiro Village. Thank you. I just want to make a note that I was only able to get here after Googling. Is that part of the game? Does Google come with the game? Why didn't I take this route here? I don't know what I'm doing. I sure named this channel properly, didn't I? Okay, I got here. Got here in the end. Oh, there's a shrine right down there. Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god, that's so cool! Whoa! Wow! That is actually very cool. Hi! Hi, did Pura send you? No, she flippin' didn't. I'm Suguru. Nice to meet you. I specialize in studying the Sky Islands. Hey, what a coincidence. So do I, sort of. I mean, look at all of these fascinating ruins just dropping out of the sky. Great stuff, right? Super great. <laughs> Uh, wait, you're not the survey- you're not with the survey team. No, I'm not in my underband, so you can tell I'm not with the survey team. This is an official Ring Ruins research site. It's dangerous here for civilians. Not exactly a civilian <laughs> either. But you're the sort of guy who comes all the way here for curiosity's sake. You must be a researcher at heart. Yes, I am. Since you're here, I'm happy to answer questions. Cool. Where do I get the paraglider? That's all I want. I bet the folks in Terrytown, oh my god, there's actually a Terrytown here in New York, could improve the balloon. I wish I had a reason to head northeast. Boy, I got reasons to head everywhere. Okay, where is Pura? I want to assassinate her for making it so difficult for me to find her. Oh, I, I, I was supposed to take the stairs and I was supposed to pass by some people, I'm sure. Hi, is that Pura? What's happening? Wake up! Please wake up! Sakura's not far off, and if he finds out someone's been sleeping on one of these stone slabs, a priceless artifact... Wow, what a douchebag. I'll be the one who gets it. That is... As a person who worked at Sotheby's, that is so freaking rude. Survey team discovered stone slabs in each of the ring ruins site here. They found this one in the ruins above us. Ah. Our leader is able to read Zonai writing and says the text on this slab is a record of a historic fight. Why the hell are you sleeping on it? Stone is not more comfortable than wood, just sleep on the wood. The ruler did not or could not defeat the demon king and instead imprisoned that mighty foe. The text also says that the sages who fought beside this ruler left something behind in case the demon king returned. What a coinky dink. It worries me to know this discovery talks about a demon king's return. And here the upheaval has just happened. You should be worried. Take your money out of Bitcoin now. <laughs> if only we knew what the sages did to prepare in case he came back. I need to know. I've got to do something about this guy. Yeah. Like stab him in the chest or something. I don't know. I'm kidding. Don't don't follow my advice. I'm, I'm totally just kidding. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean to do that either. I was, mm, I just, I meant to turn around and then, mm, sorry about that. I know, I'm fully, I'm fully on board with what you're saying, man. All right, there we go. 
Um, some translated notes. The Demon King, vast power, no hope, victory, king's own life, managed, imprison him. Imprison? Not indefinitely. Prepare, demon, rival. The sages must leave our knowledge, future generations. Reading between the lines, this stone slab seems to be a record of how the king in those days challenged the demon king. Or they were all, um, afflicted with ADHD. You never know. If I had to extrapolate the meaning, I'd guess at something like this. The reigning king had determined that they were no match for the demon king and gave his whole life to imprison the threat. Oh, that doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound like I could do that. The sages tried to leave something for the people of the future who would have to prepare for the demon king's revival. And that thing was... Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. Oh. Yeah, this, this looks about how I got here. All right, seems like I have to go below. Try to find Pura over there. Take that for later. <laughs> um, that is gonna absolutely murder me if I get caught in that water. Actually, no, I could jump off water and it's fine. Kawabunga? Oh my god, that rock is like right there. All right, hold up. What? Oh, okay. Oh, jeez. Oop, okay. Yeah, I think I'll take the stairs instead. I think that's probably best. <gasps> it's raining! Oh no! Why? Why, you Nintendo bastards, have you done? Made it raining. Okay. Wow, that's so rude. Why'd you make it raining as soon as I did something like this? Come on now. I just want to say how much I love this weapon. Oh, hey, you there. Come here! Am I in trouble? Oh. Haven't you heard? It's strictly forbidden to get near that ring ruin by Princess Zelda's orders. So you'd better be on your way. Oh. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna hear about who this Princess Zelda is that's giving all these orders. You heard me, Princess Zelda came out to Kakira Village the other day and told everyone to steer clear of that ring ruin. Okay. So did the demon take over Princess Zelda's body and he's just making appearances and saying weird things? She left in a hurry, so I didn't quite catch the why of it all. As you surely notice, these ruins come crumbling down at any time, so folks need to keep away. Um, we'll see about that. Is this Pura? Yeah. Chora, I'm not talking to you, Ben. Uh, the ring ruins are the most intriguing ruins I've researched. Especially this one. Are you in your underpants? Oh, yeah, you're part of the survey team. Especially this one, the way parts of it float up there. You have the foresight to focus on all of these special ruins and invite the survey team to take a look right oh. away. Oh, this is Paya. Okay. I... I'm no chief. I just couldn't refuse my predecessor when she decided to pass the title to me rather suddenly. Okay, I'm really a chief in name only, since I still have a great deal to... Hello! <laughs> Master Link! That's me! That's -a me! I'm so happy that I get to see you again. Hi! We met? Have we met? Was she in Breath of the Wild? And I just forgot. I'm overjoyed that both you and Princess Zelda are safe. Oh, uh, yeah. Master Lake. Uh? What? Princess Zelda is still missing. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That just confuses the matter more. You see, I actually met with the princess not too long ago. You and a few other people. It was immediately after the upheaval. Princess Zelda came here to Kakiro Village. Interesting. She orders us all to stay far away from the ring ruin, then floats above us. All right, that's where I'm headed. <laughs> I saw her myself, the princess, right before my eyes. Yeah, she's possessed. She's a demon. She left as soon as she arrived. I wasn't able to ask her anything more. The ruins don't look like it would crash down at any moment. No, it probably won't. But still, I know you would not misspeak, Master Link. No, I wouldn't. <gasps> Sunima san Master Link, I was so pleased to see you. I completely forgot common courtesy. No worries. Please allow me to introduce Mr. Turo. 
an esteemed member of the Zonai survey team. Yeah, I knew he was part of the Zonai survey team. I saw underpants and I was like, that's gotta be. Ah. I invited him here to investigate the ring ruins that fell on our village. Ah. He is incredibly deep knowledge. He's even familiar with Zonai script. Cool. Hey, dude. You look way too cool for this. Huh. There's still so much we don't understand. Indeed, yo. I think that perhaps the ruins floating in the air also has a slab that makes mention of the sages. Is that the one that the guy's sleeping on? Because he's a douchebag. In any case, I'm having trouble squaring your story about Princess Zelda with the Princess Zelda we met. She must have some reason. Uh, the... This looks like sketchy as hell. A whole village to explore! And I've got tons of money. I hope there's some stuff I can buy here. This is so cute. I want a screenshot here. Yay! Love it. Anything for me to take? Oh, examine. Ooh! Read Caleb's journey. Uh, journal. While Tour and I was taking a break, he asked me, Hey, Caleb, what attracted you to join the Zonai survey team? A little flustered, I answered that I heard its research division was led by a brilliant man by the name of Turo. Ooh, steamy seamy, because of you especially. I meant it sincerely, and in my heart, I longed to continue. You're not like those other dollards, you know. You immediately grasp the depths of my vision. <laughs> of course, no such thing passed my lips. But I'm certain that Turo, and no one else, is the man who can help the world see my indescribable worth. Hey yo. She's got a crush on Turo. I mean, he's a good looking man. He's a very good looking man. What's in here? Oh, clothes. Take my buddy. Hi. Claire. Welcome. Sorry, I must have drifted off. Oh. Okay, well, you know, rainy days can be like that. I know it won't help to talk about it, but I'm gonna do it anyways. My grandmother's really sick. I'm running the shop while my little sister, Leslie, is looking after her. We're sort of getting by. We were both so exhausted. Hope things get better. I'm sorry about this, but we really need money. I've had to hike up the prices on everything we have in stock. That's not how commerce works. You can't just raise prices and expect more money to come in. If you raise your prices, you might actually lose money. Anyways, <laughs> it's just for now, though. As soon as grandmother is healthy again, I can set our prices back to normal. You damned liar. You filthy liar. I know I shouldn't bring my home situation into the shop with me. But da da da. It's nice to get that off my chest. Yeah, whatever. Just show me your prices. Okay, where where's your there you go, there's your wares. I'm like Alright. Hi. Ooh, I thought I had money. Apparently I'm still a broke. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, these are cool though. How much do I need? So I need 5,000 for each piece, right? Oh my god, are you flipping out of your mind, people? So I need 15 here and 15 there. I need 30,000 coins. Uh, extortion. Go pick some apples. 